Hello, in this tutorial I'm going to give you a brief um, run through of what a prefab is and why they're important. And this is for people gener uh, generally that don't want to go into how, you know, how to create them. They just want to use use the prefabs or perhaps don't know they even exist. Um, so I'll give you a quick um, explanation here. So what we've got here is we've got three individual uh, static meshes, which is the array mount or speaker mount chain and array speaker here. And these can be combined into a prefab to create something like this. So what this is, generally in a concert, you'll get a, a set of array speakers that hang from your giant trussing, or if you've ever been to a festival, you'll often see them, they, they curve down and point towards the crowd. Um, so obviously you can do that by duplicating it here, you know, and so on. and getting it all right but obviously that can cause issues because you have to individually select everything so it's costing you time or if you want to if you've got say these duplicated six times um or do four times and you want to edit make an edit you want to say remove that speaker you have to go to every instance of this and imagine if you had like you could have potentially you know a hundred of these if you if you wanted in your scene so you'd be having to do that hundred times so the I, the great thing about prefab is if we click on this and we'll duplicate it uh, we'll do it three times and then if I go to the actual prefabrication that's been uh, created what you can do is say we want to remove this second speaker here all you got to do is select the second speaker done it on everything same thing if you want to move that one up or you know you can do anything you want with it it's instantly done so you, as I say you could have hundred hundred of these and it's instantly done and um, you don't have to worry about anything it's also ideal for um, creating scenes incredibly fast so a lot of here we go I've got another prefab here three separate pieces all pieced together to create a guitar cab these steps were two pieces together to create the steps I've got trussing here um, stage as you see that was sort of would be five pieces together with all these little black rubber things and you just drag it out it's done um, now a lot of people don't realize that when they buy an asset pack from the marketplace for instance that a lot of these projects actually contain prefabs now if you purchase some of them, um, any of my, my packs, um, I often put them under the blueprints folder. So you'll get blueprints, and as you can see here, there's a selection of them um, already created. You know, we drag this one out. That's got you a roof truss or whatever you want to use it for. And um, often people will put it either under the blueprints or in a separate prefabs folder. I always put it under blueprints because I never really do any blueprint coding. So, you know, it's never going to get in a mess. But yeah, um, they're incredibly good for creating scenes fast. So if we look at this stage here, everything here is used off of a prefab. Um, so, you know, we can go there. They're all prefabs. They're all uh, prefabs. They've got actual pieces on the speaker themselves. The staging is... Um, drum riser here so as you can see you could create this scene using prefabs incredibly quickly and always make sure as I say when you buy your asset packs check there first because it can really help you create scenes rather than a lot of people go to the individual mes meshes and try to create you know scenes using these which sometimes you can get in this case it's 56 um, meshes but sometimes you can get in, you know in the thousands which would just be ridiculous so yeah hopefully that helps if you want to uh, know how to create a prefab i do have another tutorial on this and um, that will go you know how to set up one it's, it's pretty simple but i thought i'd just separate them for people that aren't interested in how to create them so if you found this helpful please give a like and maybe subscribe thanks